Uh, hi, my name is Tom Antos and today I wanted to show you guys how I do uh, basically movie props, uh, prop guns or, uh, or basically movie guns uh, in my films. And, um, you know, I get often asked, you know, Tom, you know, where do you get the guns for your films? And, and then, uh, you know, and f do you do anything special to them uh, before you start filming? And, uh, and uh, you know, f it, f to answer that question, I guess, you know, most of my guns or most of the guns that I use in films are actually uh, fake, you could say replica guns or just basically toy guns that you can buy, you know, at, at your local uh, toy store. Now, uh, all of those are, or most of them at least, are, are pre pretty much made out of plastic. Uh, and to make them look more sort of realistic, or not necessarily realistic as in real life, but more uh, what you would expect to see in a movie, uh, you know, like when you watch basically big Hollywood films, when you see guns, they're usually very, uh, you know, they use like, they look like they've been really used up. Like they have, you know, the paint, the, the black protective paint sort of scratched off. You see a lot of the metal kind of, you know, s you know c coming in from underneath. And that's simply because, you know, uh, the, the those big Hollywood films, they usually rent the guns uh, from, you know, like a mov movie prop place uh, and they're constantly being used these guns and so um, you know just with more usage and you know each time the gun gets dropped or or or, uh, or just you know misused uh, the paint will will start scratching up and then you're gonna start seeing the metal under, underneath it uh, in real life actually most people really take care of their guns uh, so you know whether it's police force or you know private gun gun owners uh, they usually have guns that look very nice uh, and and which means you actually wouldn't really see the metal underneath it so it looks just like a plain black kind of you know matte paint uh, on the guns um, which could in a way look sometimes you know like like a plastic gun uh, so you know unless really somebody is using actively their gun and like in a, in a battlefield or some you know active war zone uh, you're not really gonna uh, see real real guns looking that way necessarily but for movies you want to you see you sort of want to replicate what you expect to see based on uh, on all these Hollywood action films so these are the, the guns we're gonna use for the film and they're all airsoft guns but to make them look more real or more like like movie guns, you know, like like they're used and that kind of stuff. Uh, what I'm doing is just you know uh, the ones that had the orange tip. I had to paint the tip with black paint, and now I got this uh, metallic kind of silver paint, spray paint, and I'm gonna apply these um, like these kind of accents here. So to, to make it look like it's like the you know the bluing on the gun is rubbed off, and you see them the metal underneath. So. So just spray a little bit somewhere like on some piece of paper. And when you get that, take a little sponge and dip it in there. And so you wanna you wanna just make sure they have a very small amount of paint on there on the brush. And um, like when you touch it with your finger, you should just leave like a slight mark. And then uh, uh, and then you just kind of what you wanna do is you just paint the edges here. By just rubbing the sponge like that on the edges, uh, let's see here, and all that's gonna do is just it's gonna the paint will just rub off on those the, the the edges that stick out the most, and it will look almost as if your gun has been kind of used up, you know, dropped during a firefight or something. It basically will look less like it's a new gun. So here you can see like all those edges here and. Here on the front, like I just added that sort of silvery metallic paint, and it just makes it look more like a, like a, you know, like a real gun. And that's it. It's got to do it to all of them. Uh, if you guys are interested in, in seeing this finished film where I used the, 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 these guns, then check out my website tomantosfilms.com. Uh, I have uh, links there to uh, you know to the to the film itself as well as other tutorials about the making of this film. Uh, you know how I did the action scenes, color correction, that kind of stuff. Plus, you know, uh, over seven hours of other free uh, filmmaking tutorials, uh, which are usually based on my other films and, and projects that I work on. Uh, thank you, and see you guys next time.